But as Cinnabar, I didn't... That character rarely interacts with anyone other than Foss. And then I think uh, Diamond at one point. But exactly what Kat said, there's buzz all around the studio about Land of the Lustrous. And I so desperately wanted to be a part of it. And I remember um, they had the audition sides all out. And I was excited. And I was like leafing through all of them. And the one character I was convinced I was not going to get was Cinnabar. Because I was just like, this character is so intense. And they have such a, uh, a depth to them. And again, I was very new. And so I, uh, I read a little bit of the manga at the time, which is excellent. I highly recommend it to anyone who wants to read something that they're not going to expect <laughs> where it ends up. Uh, but the audition process was exciting because there's a scene, I think in episode one, where Cinnabar throws their mercury out in this like massive wave. <laughs> Um, and it was the first time I got to do kind of like an action-esque within an anime. This audition, I had to like put my whole force into it. And I remember, <laughs> I never told anyone this, I was trying so hard to impress Kyle that I strained too hard when I was doing my effect and I pulled a muscle in my butt. So uh, it paid off, obviously. Land of the Lustrous paid off. That, that's how you get it, kids. You just pull a butt muscle. Mm -hmm.